Hello, this is again Patrick from Patrick Source, and today I want to introduce my instruments to you. How did I get to play these instruments, you may ask? Well, from I was very little, singing and playing music was really me. When I could sing and play music, I was in another world. I was able to look beyond my imperfect childhood that you may have had too. Music on some level maybe was my escape, but it also was my truth. I started off with the accordion and singing and later on I played the clarinet. And all of this came away. And what came to me was this. A flute. They call it Cherokee in the Americas and originally these type of flutes they were made like that in Northern America by the Indians, by the Native Americans. So maybe the flute was not so far away from the clarinet but something had changed. I learned to play and read music and I was almost studying music and then this flute came. It's made to the Northern American example, but it really comes from Australia. At that time I lived in New Zealand and I had seen some shamans coming to New Zealand playing flutes and I thought, this is me. So I found this guy online in Australia who made this beautiful flutes. I could choose the wood, which is a very exotic wood, comes from Australia. I forgot the name, please forgive me, maybe you know. So it just arrived, made to my energy at the time. What's different here? Well, you learn how the flute plays you. So let's call that my first Australian love, because now I have a whole collection. And in this series, I will introduce three to you, four. So three more. Three of them have been made for me and one I found on the market and wanted to be with me. So what's different with these flutes? They are pentatonic and in pentatonics you don't really have mistunes or anything like that. And they say that the pentatonic is what is the tone inside of our body. When I was a musician playing the clarinet, I played the clarinet. Not like that, because this flute plays me. What are we doing with the flutes, with the other instruments that we're having? We are creating sound that comes intuitively to a particular topic, to a particular theme. We use it for activations. We use it for instruments on the path of actualization, as I call it. To stay connected, to stay real, to understand our truth and to transcend into whatever we need to be. So let me give you a little taste of the Australian love. It's an honor to be played by an instrument and I'm happy to share with you how it all comes into being. So this was the Australian Love. Stay tuned for the next. <laughs>